Hey guys, it's Friday again, and you know what that means. It's time for another episode of Click Tips. Click Tips are where we give you quick tips that will make you more productive throughout your day. So this week we're going to be talking about something that's extremely useful, especially if you're somebody who uses a lot of list templates. So let's come over here, and we'll go ahead and we'll, oh, and we'll create a new list from template. So we click that. Let's say, let's go ahead and name this one New Sprint. So this is the new sprint that we're working on. We click Sprint. And then right down here, there's this button to remap due dates. Now, if we click this, it will go ahead and it will remap all the due dates based off of where they were in the um, in the template. So, for example, if we had some tasks that were due on the first day, they'll be due on the first day, and then which will be this Monday. And then if we had some that were due two days later, they'd be due on that Wednesday, and so on and so forth. We're going to click here to import all of them as open, and then we're also going to remap the start dates relative to due dates. So, if the start dates were a week before those due dates, then you'll see them a week before when we go ahead and create this list. So we'll go ahead and create it, and we'll come take a look at it here. And you see here that all of the due dates are mapped similarly to what I just said. And you'll see that if it doesn't have a due date, um, obviously it won't be mapped. So let's go ahead and take a look at this in time view. And you can see here it's got the entire week planned out. So this is really useful if, you're, uh, if your team does use sprints, for example, and then anyone that didn't have a due date, we can just go ahead and drag them on here. But yeah, that's all I got for you this week, guys. Thanks so much for watching, and have a great rest of your day.